video and look different for people. All right. So this is it. So I live with Valley Renter for a year. I first of all I live with Oscar for nine almost nine almost ten years. And then I had to move for family emergency for some reason to travel to Delaware for some time. And then I came back. <clears throat> so I had to find a quick place. So I rent with Valley Renter in some place that I really didn't like. But I just wanted to be there for a year before I found a decent place like where I am now. So uh, when I moved there, the carpet was not looking good. So I asked them if they're gonna change the carpet. They said, "Oh, we don't, we didn't change the carpet. We changed the carpet not too long ago." So all the holes and dams that are in the carpet, I took all the picture. I took all the picture of the things that when I leave in the year time, they might send my name to collection. I figured that because Oxford did not do that because I lived there for almost 10 years and there was no joy on the wall, there was no hole on the wall, there was no destruction in any carpet or anything in the apartment. I leave it clean just I met it because I put everything in the storage. In your lifetime, things change at time and then you have to make some decision like quickly you have to go and you have to do what you have to do. When you have children that in your lifetime that you'll be able to make some decisions so you can fix something in order to protect your family or to protect, you know, something that important to you. Not gonna tell what that is, but that's how far that can go. So <clears throat> living with these people for a year when I moved, they you know, send me a paper, they have my five hundred dollar deposit, but they don't want to give that to me. So they kinda make uh, they, they make a paper saying, you know, it's my ledger or something like that and send it to me because I request, because they send me your paper said I'm owing, I'm owing $3,000 or something, but then out of the $3,000, I have to pay 200 and something dollar. So I'm wondering why I have to pay only this and not all this money. So because they don't want to give my security deposit. So I went to them to them and said, you guys change the carpet they say yeah I say okay i need all the proof oh we can get the proof but we can get this and that they sent me something that looked there it was updated but they just went in the computer changed the date and the time it might be for somebody else's apartment but they just went in the computer and changed the date and the time because people have software to do that these days and i can do that too on my computer i can change this in time of or old document and be able to send it and it looks just profit so people intend to uh apartment complaint intend to steal from tenants because if this day when you're moving in any apartment please take all the picture if you let do a video my i didn't do the video because i was in hurry to do a lot of things so i just took a lot of picture i took my time i took all the pictures some of them i included my feet and my skirt beginning in it because you know and the rope i have in my phone is all over there it's all showing everywhere so nobody say oh she took the i mean picture differently and the very day i'm moving this at the same day before i moved in that same day i took all the picture because it keep all the dates and time on it uh, on it the, the the picture so I took all the picture and then I kept them the whole time over there. I just uploaded it on my computer because in case the phone lost or you can still get your data back this day anyway if the phone lost. Although I changed my phone but I still kept all the data. So when I got new computer the feed I transferred everything on my laptop and I still have my old laptop. I haven't even done anything with it and everything still on the too. So so I did that and all this stuff still on my phone they're still on my phone too so so when i received the letter i went to them and told them and, and asked them you guys change the carpet they said yeah we change the carpet and there's no reason that said you can't change the carpet because i stayed there for a year and i got a cleaning carpet machine from uh this place a family fair my kid my son washed all the room all the room the carpet he got no carpet in the living room and the hallway and other thing but in the room all the carpet in the room he clean everything we use the machine to clean everything because i rented so the people still have the document if i lost mine i can still go there and request the the one they can photo copy and give me the copy so we clean the whole carpet before we let we clean everything the wall everything sparkling somebody can just move in there if they if they want to move with somebody in there 
but they said they, they changed the carpet and i don't see any reason that they would change the carpet when i was moving in they didn't change the carpet so one year and then you change the carpet and you pay all that money to change carpet i don't believe that for what we change the carpet so because of this part that was there when i moved that's the reason they said they changed the carpet but i had all the picture mm -hmm. i had all the picture so I put some of the pictures together today because they sent my name to collection with a three thousand something dollar that I owe and, and uh, another one to my son so we can pay that. So today I wrote a letter and then I have few of the pictures, the before and after, just few, not all of them, just few, maybe four or five pictures I add on the uh, thing and, and email it to them because email people do this day. So. <clears throat> Let me see. So I just sent an email to them. Let me see. It's right here. So the picture. So I say first, I say first, I say I first moved to Oxford apartment complex May to May uh 23rd. May, yeah, May 1st, 2013, up to 2021 before I moved. I've never you know, kept any evidence. However, uh, I can't up. however, the nine years, the nine year I live at Oxford, my children never drew on the wall or put hole in the wall, destroy the carpet or destroy the apartment <clears throat> or destroy the apartment. We live at your apartment. I mean, you know, Valley Renter, your apartment for one year. You never change the carpet, but you, but you never change the carpet. You only clean the carpet. That's all they did. They only clean the carpet, and now they claim me they change it because they didn't send me any evidence. Please send me back my security deposit of what left. Because if you say I'm owing you, I will lay one one month. That's what I can remember. The reason I was late is because I was lazy. I was sleeping. That's why. And when I got up, I just passed. I usually drop it up. At night on the first or second day before I go to work <clears throat> overnight and then when they get there in the morning before they go upstairs they will collect their meal before they go so they'll be able to see it but when you drop it three I mean 3 p.m. later it will be late so but I always drop it up that time or maybe earlier before I figure you know you can pay rent online before I start paying my rent online so <clears throat> So I asked them to send me my security deposit of what left. So I just said these are some of the these are these are just a few pictures for before and after when I'm moving and then before I left. So these days you got to be prepared when you move into an apartment because everybody they are thieves. Apartment complex. I don't know of this one I'm living in, but I know most apartment complex are thieves. They try to steal from you and never be fair to you because they want to earn more than they should so make sure you keep your you keep your paper you keep every paper you keep every picture picture is a perfect evidence for anything you want to do because nobody can deny picture nobody will deny the date nobody will deny the time especially the time and the day nobody will deny that because if you're there you took the picture it's going to show the date and time and sometimes where you are that day if you have your location on on your phone so these people send me they send my name to collection say i'm owing you know this three thousand something dollar which i i'm not owing them a dime but because they want to steal money from me so they went that far to say i owe so much of that so you see you never trust anyone this day nobody me for once i had no trust in anything that breathe on this planet you can lie with me for how much you want pretend you are this kind of a good person me i'm gonna lie with you too but i will never trust you the only person i trust on the planet that's include my kid i only trust god because only god know the secret heart of every man only God knows the heart of every man. I cannot read your mind. So you can only laugh with me 
and pretend to laugh with me for all I know. So life a part of a permanent complex work this day. They try so if you if you move into a place, take pictures. If you are leaving, take pictures. Make sure you do that. Take pictures. And keep all of those pictures. And make sure you keep them. Like you keep your own dirty pictures. Make sure you do that. Because apartment complex, trust me. When you are moving in, they're going to send the person that want to the apartment. Quick way and say, they want that, they want that, they want that. They're going to have that. But then when you are moving, they're going to send a one woman, the Asian woman, they send her. She stood in one spot for 30 minutes while waiting. I said, you know what, I'm not yet to wait for this. Then foolish day, I just took my you know, yeah, let go down and go put our thing in the car and get out of here. So I went and took all the pictures that I need to take and leave her standing there. I don't have time for that foolishness. You you came to check the apartment for me to move in. Quick, quick, within a minute, you are done. Now you stay in one place for 30 minutes, writing some foolishness. What do you think I get time for that? I have all the pictures that I already needed. So you like it, you can stay there for an hour and write all your pictures because you think you know they broke in your hair. So the people send you to become their thief. You become the rebel for, for, for apartment complex. You that they can send to go, you know, or, or check the picture. I mean, take the picture. You become the. You become the. 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 the <clears throat> you become the. 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 the backup boom for the people. They use you like a thief too, so you can be able to steal from good people that work hard for the money. It's not gonna work like that. So for me, if I'm moving apartment these day, whatever it did I see that not good, I take the picture. Because I know there's nothing will be destroyed in our apartment. My, I have a five-year-old 